Belarus. Her biggest dream is to become an ambassador for her country. She hopes that more people can visit Belarus and appreciate its beauty once it is safe for people to travel again. Belarus. Costa Rica. Leave the place better than we found it. That's the adage she lives by. And she would like to encourage people to adapt a lifestyle centered on environmental care. Costa Rica. Cote d'Ivoire. After working in a pharmaceutical company, she decided to open her own natural cosmetics company that celebrates beauty of all colors. Cote d'Ivoire. Denmark. Her family created the Zero to Hero Foundation to help poor families and send children to school in Thailand's countryside. Denmark. Germany. As a step to help the environment, she encourages young women like her to use makeup to switch to natural, organic cosmetics that are free from animal testing and are plastic-free. Germany. Japan. After she finishes her university education, she plans to delve into research and using her experience as Miss Earth Japan, hopes to collaborate with others in doing environment-related work. Japan. Kenya. She believes that to be an environmentalist is to do things from the heart without expecting anything in return. Kenya. Myanmar. Growing up in a rural region surrounded by nature, she advocates for the preservation of the Ayurgamwari River, which is considered as the lifeblood of her country. Myanmar. Netherlands. With her background in communications, she was able to work with her local government's crisis team against COVID-19 to help flatten the curve. Netherlands. Nigeria. She has this message for travelers. Choose an adventure that is carbon offsetting. Pack light, don't leave any trash behind, and bring home happy memories from the trip. Nigeria. Panama. As an electromechanical engineering student, she hopes to one day generate projects focused on renewable energy. Panama. Philippines. When asked how she sees herself in the next five years, this tourism graduate says she would continue to work in the agriculture sector and speaking on environmental imbalance caused by human action. Philippines. Poland. She's a self-confessed beach lover. That's why she chose to compete against plastic pollution, which is currently affecting the seas in different parts of the world. Portugal. She believes that inclusion is an important factor in environmental preservation. More people getting involved in the cause regardless of race or social status can lead to better results. Portugal. Puerto Rico. With more people turning to social media since the pandemic outbreak, she would like to take advantage of this opportunity as an influencer to reach out to netizens and spread awareness about the environment. Puerto Rico. Singapore. Dancing has taught her life skills such as discipline, time management, and confidence. And being a dance teacher, she would like to pass this on to her students. Singapore South Africa Waste Stops With Me is her chosen advocacy which supports community cleanup drives, tree planting, and educating children on the importance of the environment. South Africa Thailand 
The pandemic outbreak gave her the opportunity to give rather than take. She worked closely with the Miracle of Life Foundation to help the less fortunate and those who have been greatly affected by the pandemic all over Thailand. As a Having traveled to various parts of the world gave her a different perspective in life and about the environment. She hopes that measures could be done to solve the water crisis affecting the world. You as a Venezuela This law graduate believes that sustainability starts by educating young minds and by leading through example. Venezuela